Hey guys! So it's been a very long time, and according to this cute little Christmas card that I got in the mail, it's been 12 years. Um, it really has been a long time. I actually cannot use the uh, punky 2 a 2 a 2 a account anymore because it was linked to my old phone number, and I kid you not, a little girl has my phone number now. It wouldn't even happen. I actually tried, I attempted, failed miserably, so that account is obsolete. And it had a lot of views, which was really strange to me. Um, <laughs> I don't know how that happened. I guess people find it entertaining seeing someone in a bathroom trying snacks. Uh, unfortunately, I won't be doing that this year, <laughs> eating snacks in a bathroom, just because um, I found that a little strange myself, but at the time of filming that 12 years ago, that was literally the only spot in the house that had no one in it, and my mom's house was pretty cluttered as it was. Uh, my friend Penn got me this huge box, and I've been waiting for it uh, since she told me about it, and I was super excited about it, so thank you so very much. I appreciate you. You are so kind, and this little card was the first thing I read, and it was really sweet, and talking about how long it's been, and to uh, give my love to my children. I have two boys now. Um, they are wonderful little kids, and they can be a pain in the butt though. So this entire box has mommy monster noodle snacks. Wow, that is amazing. Well, this is going to be a shorter video than I thought and that is a-okay with me. I don't mind at all. Sorry if the crinkling is a little too much. My bad. I think it's four flavors. I'm really, really hoping it's not more than that. I have green, pink, red, and brown. They look like this. Well, one of them does. Let me uh, adjust my little thing here. They are called Mommy Monster Noodle Snacks. So normally when people eat noodles, they boil it um, for a little bit and then eat it with like, you know, water and a soup, essentially. But these you're just literally supposed to crush up and put them in your mouth and there's like a little powder in there that you shake it up. And I've always loved them. They were really, really good back in the day. And she kind of knew that, so, wow. I'm not even joking when I'm saying this is an entire box of these. I love them so much. It's going to take me a lot longer to eat these than I had anticipated. Um, so the first flavor we have is black pepper. There we go, black pepper. Second one is barbecue, which was the first one I ever tried. And that was the best one. And then we have spicy. Ooh, interesting. And finally, the chicken flavor. Chicken. Again, I only had three? Two of these. Two of these ones. And it's kind of funny, they have like Spongebob on some of them. <laughs> that means my kids are going to want to try them because Spongebob, why not, right? So this has a black pepper. I'm out of focus. I'm so sorry. I can't really see from where I am. They're already like brown browner than the other ones. The barbecue ones are like a kind of like a light orange color. These are brown. And they come with the little seasoning packet. So like you can eat them like this if you don't really want the seasoning. But what, where's the fun in that? So you crush it. I'll eat it without it first. Oh, got on the rug. <laughs> it's just like savory flavor. Mommy-ish. There's a little, a teeny bit of heat in the back. I wonder if it's already peppered. Oh, that's weird. It's already peppered. So is this just more pepper? <laughs> we shall see what it is. Hopefully I don't get on my microphone. By the way, thanks babe for the new microphone. Do you hear me? I hear myself. Um, so I have scissors and I'm apparently just ruining this video by not using them. White powder. Oh, it's sweet. It's like a sugary chicken. It's almost like chicken stock, but a sweeter chicken stock. That'd be good in regular noodles. <laughs> you just pour it in. And it's not focused. I'm so sorry. Close it up. Check it up. Make sure you squished it first. Otherwise this wouldn't shake very well. I'm not going to attempt at reading the non-English words, I would feel terrible mispronouncing anything. Now it smells like chicken bouillon. 
with pepper. Okay, here we go. Mm. Do you have like this ASMR thing going on and it picks up all the sounds around you? Okay, I'm sorry. That could probably like irk somebody. <laughs> um, it's like got a kick to it. Definitely spicy, but not like ouch, I'm burning. I don't want to eat it anymore spicy. More like, you know, tolerable spicy. It's good. Thank you. We'll go with the spicy. Why not? We just had semi-spicy. Now we're going to kick up the heat to more spicy. The scissors. All right. We got... These are more orange than the actual barbecue ones. Smell it, crunch it, shake it, munch it without the sauce powder. Oh, upon first taste, if you will, it's just very salty. It's almost got like a ketchup flavor. That is really bizarre. Hello, it's a little spicy. So now I'm gonna try the powder it comes with. I'm actually afraid because I do not like too spicy. Although lately I've been eating a lot of blue Takis for some reason and I don't know why. Uh, I apparently don't know how to use scissors either and I was blabbing and didn't use it. All right, upon inspection, we have even more orange powder. Oh, okay. It's salty though. Ooh, okay. It's spicy. I'm still gonna pour it all in. This is for you guys. Don't fail me, SpongeBob. Oh God. It goes into your nose. Oh, that's bad. But good bad. Okay. That's pretty good. It's kind of ketchupy with a little bit of like, maybe cayenne pepper, I think. It's pretty good. Thank you. Next is the chicken. Is green apparently. That's, ooh, this one opened easy. Doesn't smell like chicken. It um, it kind of looks similar to the barbecue one. Oh, very muted flavor, but still there. I don't know how that makes sense. You do taste chicken without really putting the seasoning in. It's so funny, but my boyfriend's uh, working right now behind me. <laughs> I wonder if uh, he can hear me. So that's just straight up salt. Oh god. Oh. I have no brain. It's done. It left the building with all the sodium. Round three. These ones are not my favorite. They're kind of saltier than the other three. I don't know. It's not my favorite. Final one. Barbecue. Which was the first one I ever tried. I loved it so much. Why does it say it's limited edition? Is it just because of Spongebob? Because barbecue is the best flavor ever. Hands down. Here we go. All right, really good. Got it. Ugh, let me just uh, close up of that beautiful thing. Without the seasoning. Mmm. I can dig it without it, but definitely this. So I'm just gonna try the seasoning by itself. Sweet, salty, savory. Almost chicken broth. But you do taste like that, like, like the sweetness of something. Like, barbecue obviously it probably is like a molasses oh that one had a lot of shelf on it it's still really good though i'm gonna have to say the seasoning for the first one was so good i bet that would be really good in this one because i like the original flavor of nothing with the brown it's almost like pungently like ketchup with barbecue sauce people eat that anyway i'm getting crumbs all over the floor good thing the kids are gone that was it this entire box is um, staying here with me. Promise you I won't need it all. <laughs> I don't think that would be physically possible. Thank you so much, Pen. This is wonderful. A big box for her. Actually, I'll be right back. I'm gonna show you some of the things I got her. So, this is what I'm getting her. This is a can of Chalkies Fuego Crisps. I don't think they're from the same brand. Uh, no, it's Bimbo. So it's not like the Pringles. They're just like super duper hot and then they use the Fuego Chalky Powder. Ignore that. Then we have these. I actually bought myself these um, the same day that I bought these. And I burnt my mouth. And I gave them away immediately because they were just 
really stinking hot or barbecue flaming hot again with the flaming hot she just loves spicy stuff so i was like okay i'm gonna find like the hottest stuff ever i burnt myself i gave them away and the dude that tried them <laughs> he coughed at the table and he's like i don't want these so <laughs> beware my friend and we have these again with the taqui fuego theme if you will they are hot nuts Go ahead and laugh all you want. Um, they got chili and lime on them, so you're tasting like a like tangy type of spice. Um, a lot of people like these, especially on the go. Then we have this zombie Tuckies. They are habanero and cucumber. I've never had them, but they were there and I was like, sure. Finally, we have with the spicy stuff, uh, Tuckies, new apparently. Uh, sweet dragon chili. Spicy sweet chili pepper. That doesn't tell me much. Cayenne pepper and paprika and uh... I don't know what else is in it. It's just spicy. And uh, this one you can't really see but I could show it to you anyway. Spicy popcorn. Like I literally have been eating off of the other ones in the back there. It's just got this like red like oily stuff on it and when you pop it in the microwave it's like buttery and um very freaking hot beware my friend finally i have this but um i'm not done shopping for her stuff yet i still have to go get beef jerky that i really really love to get if if anyone lives in the state of texas and you know where a loves gas station is go there immediately like stop what you're doing uh stop going stop breathing well don't do that because then you might die drive there give me a little vehicle and in the aisle with the beef jerky they have this one specifically that they have like the Loves logo on it and they collab with a, I actually forgot the name of it. I will put all the information in the description box. Um, it is the most delicious beef jerky I've ever had. It's very peppered. It's not even that salty, which I hate salty beef jerky. I don't understand why people eat salty and sugared beef jerky that's disgusting it tastes like it's supposed to like beef I have to get that soon but this is the last thing i have it is a chocolate frosted donut kit kat and i just wanted to buy it for her and see if maybe she liked it i didn't really care for it um i gave that one away too but i don't really like like super sweet stuff so i'm weird like that but thank you for watching this wonderful video i have been blabbing for the last 22 minutes and first video but not the last Right back at you. I don't know. Bye. <laughs>